Hello and welcome back to ADK Aquatics and today we are doing a species showdown between checkered barbs and chili rasboras. As always they will be judged on five categories. In this episode these will be lifespan, color, wow factor, pickiness, and hardiness. Let's get into it. First I will be judging chili rasboras on lifespan. Chili rasboras have an average lifespan of around six years with some sources saying 6 to 8 years and others saying 4 to 8. So there's a bit of a discrepancy, but it seems like the consensus is that the max lifespan of a Chili Rasbora is usually 8 years. I will give them a 6.5 out of 10 for lifespan. Meanwhile, checkered barbs have an average lifespan of 2 to 4 years, but can live much longer with extremely good care. I will give them a 5 out of 10 for lifespan. Next up, I am going to do the collar category. This will be difficult for me to judge as both of these fish have extremely beautiful colors when cover colored up, but I will give it my best try. Checkered barbs look absolutely stunning when colored up, especially the males. They have a really cool mix of orange and dark gray that mixes together to make this really cool brownish color on their body. It might just be because my favorite color is orange, but I think these are some of the best looking fish in the, in the hobby. I will give them a 9.5 out of 10 for color. Chili rasboras also look very cool when colored up, with their intense orangish red coloration set off by the black band along their body. They take a while to fully color up though, but once they do, their colors are hard to beat. They will receive a 9.5 out of 10 as well. Our next category is wow factor. Chili rasboras don't have too much wow factor compared to a fish like pea puffers or coolie loaches as they look pretty much like a normal fish and have normal fish qualities. They are unique in one way though. They are one of the smallest species of fish in the world as they reach a maximum size of only 3 quarters of an inch. This will be cool to people who aren't familiar with chili rasboras as they may be shocked because they might not be familiar with vertebrates that can get that small. This is why they will receive a 6.5 out of 10 for wow factor. Checkered barbs on the other hand don't have as much of a wow factor because when you see them they just, they just look like your average freshwater aquarium fish. Their only noticeable features are their cool coloration and the barbs on the on their mouth which makes them look like a mini koi almost. They will receive a 4 out of 10 for wow factor. Our next category is pickiness or how hard it is to get them to eat food. Checkered barbs aren't picky at all in my experience. I'm pretty sure there isn't a food that I've tried to feed them that they have refused to eat. They eat dry, frozen, and live food. I have fed them crisps, pellets, flake, and powder food. They will receive a 10 out of 10 in pickiness. Chili rasboras are also not picky at all, though they can't eat a lot of foods because of their tiny mouths. This, limit, this limits them to just crushed up flake food, powder food, and micro pellet food. Along with baby brine shrimp and micro worms and other small live and frozen food if you want to feed them that kind of food. For these reasons, I will give them an 8 out of 10 for pickiness. It is now time for our last category, hardiness. Chili rasboras are decently fragile when you first get them home, as they are sold when they are very frail. When I bought mine home, two died before I can even put them in the tank. But I haven't had any other problems with them since. I would say that once you get them established in your tank, they are fairly hardy, 
but when you first get them, they can be fragile and weak. So I will give them a 6.5 out of 10 for hardiness. Checkered barbs, on the other hand, have given me no problems since I've got them, and I think they are a very hardy fish and will receive an 8.5 out, out of 10 for hardiness. It is now time for our final score, and you may be surprised to hear this, but this is the first species showdown ever to result in a tie, with both the Chiliras Boras and the Checkered Barbs finishing with an average score of 7.4 out of 10. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.